The FNA process is useful in two situations, so it would allow you to sample a tumour from a specimen that perhaps you didn't want to open, um, possibly because you didn't want to compromise the surgical margins. And um, It may also be useful if you've got a sample that you have opened but the tumour is actually very small. The process actually involves you taking a fine needle, so a small needle at the moment we're using a 22 gauge needle, um, onto the end of a 10 millimeter syringe and then FNAing the specimen, so you hold it steady with one hand and then just insert the needle into the tumour with the other hand, avoiding your hands at all costs, and actually just applying some suction onto the syringe and moving the needle and the syringe into and out of the tumour and sucks up into the barrel of the needle some of the tumour cells, which can then be washed into either PBS or lysate. And at the moment we're putting our samples into both solutions as we're in a process of establishing which is better in terms of preserving the specimen.